Hey there and welcome to another Diverse Solutions video tutorial. In today's tutorial we're going to walk you through the process of adding uh, DS Search Agent, your new mapping IDX, to your website. So the first thing you want to do is you want to log into your control panel. Once you're there, you're going to go ahead and hover over DS Search Agent. Click on that. It's going to bring up a new page. Now on that new page, what we want to do is we want to scroll all the way down You'll notice a section that says add IDX to your site. You won't need to select from the drop down for target length. Uh, your account will only be limited to the MLS that you've been approved with. So over on the right hand side you'll notice a frame HTML code. What you want to do is you want to copy this page you want to copy paste this code onto the appropriate page of your website. The way the mapping solution works is you don't need to adjust the width and height it's an auto adjusting iframe that means that it's going to adjust uh, auto adjust to fit the full width and height as permitted by your page so here I've logged into my WordPress dashboard I've clicked on add new and I'm going to title this page search for homes you're going to toggle from your visual editor over to your HTML editor you're going to paste your script code and in this case some WordPress themes have varying uh, page templates. My recommendation would be if you have the option to select a full width template, then select the full width template. In this case, we're given just a default template. Go ahead and hit publish. And voila, you have your new page with your DS Search Agent mapping IDX embedded on that page. Now, there's one more step that you want to take. You're going to grab your URL, in this case it's yoursite.com forward slash search for homes or some variation thereof. And you want to go to your control panel, click on hover over DS search agent, click on options, and all the way on the right hand side you're going to see a sec uh, tab that reads domains. Go ahead and click on that tab and here you're going to place the URL of the page where you're housing the mapping IDX. The reason for this is that the URL that you enter on this page, is, as it says here, is going to be used as the base for any links that are generated with your IDX. So if you use a map module, a widget, a quick search, anywhere on your website, when somebody clicks on a link to view a listing, it's going to take them to the mapping solution housed on this page as opposed to the default idx.diversesolution.com. Thanks for listening and stay tuned for more DS Search Agent video tutorials. Yeah, I know.